Howdy folks, and welcome back to Sailing Slow Motion. Today, we are on the boat. And although we're on the boat, we're not actually going sailing today. We might go paddle boarding, but we're not going sailing. What we're doing today is we're going to put these vinyl stickers, which are pretty decent size, on the bow of the boat. And to do that, we are going to have to clean the side and be able to stand there. So we are going to use the stand-up paddleboard as our deck board that we're going to be able to sit on or stand on. And the vinyl stickers are going to go right on the bow on either side. Now to clean it, I'm going to use my hose. And this is the hose that I use. It's one of these expandable hoses. And I love this thing because it doesn't take up any space on the boat. I don't leave it attached to the dock. I always take it off and then store it on the boat but I love this thing it's like just packs away so small and it works great so this little pocket hose has a jet nozzle attached to it already it came with it so just gonna give this a nice little rinse and then we'll use just a dab of Dawn dish soap and a rag and then rinse that off and then once it dries we'll be able to apply our vinyl. Okay, so we got it washed and dried. Well, we got it washed and it's drying. I'm gonna use a paper towel and just kind of wipe it down, make sure there's no big grit on there. It seems pretty clean already. This is the tricky part. Oh, it didn't fall in yet. <laughs> That's good. So I'm gonna use this post as my center. It's gonna go right in here. do is go ahead and get tape started. All right, so now we're pulling it off for the big reveal. I'm sweaty, but going slow, obviously. Let's see if I can catch any errors. But it's looking really good. All right, I'm gonna stop and then I'll show you guys the finished deal here. Oh yeah, that looks pretty nice. I think it really makes the boat kind of pop a little bit better. I could have come down a little bit more maybe, but actually I like it. I like the positioning. I'll just have to do the other one the exact same, but the other side will be easy because I'll be able to sit on the dock itself. Okay, so now we just got to do this again. I measured the other side and I need to come one finger length down. So it'll start right there to be even.
boat's kind of walking away from me a little bit. I pulled it tight, but not tight enough apparently. Since we're here by a big logo, I want to explain a little something about it. So, some people know, some people don't. But in the center of the ship's wheel is a big E, right? So, my very first job was working at KFC, and the guy that owned it, I won't say his name, uh, he would always write my checks as C-A-S-Y, and then my last name and never put the E in there. And I kept telling him, I was like, you got to put the E in my name. I'm, you got to sign these checks and then cash them at the bank was back in the 90s. And he didn't put the E in there for months. Many, many months went by. So I was sitting in study hall in high school and I was trying to find a way to put my name in just an E so I could put that on my time card. And so this is what I came up with. So there's the C. The A, this is supposed to have a little spot in it, but the A, the S, the E, and the Y, so Casey. So my time cards for several months just had that big E on it until he finally put the E into my name on my checks. So <laughs> that's why that's on there. So KFC was my first job. This one hopefully is my last job. And um, I just wanted to have a little memento of that. So that's why the E's in there. All right, so looks like I have to adjust the camera up just a little bit, but. We are going to go out and see. I haven't been on a paddleboard in many months. And before those many months, I was only on a paddleboard a couple times. So my experience is pretty limited. <laughs> but I'm learning. Uh, just like everything else, slow and steady. If I'm on a paddleboard, I'm probably going in the water. Let's see, let's see what I can do. The real question is, you be able to see me or not? I probably should have. So as far as you can tell, I'm up and doing fine. <laughs> I am actually right next to the boat still. I don't know if you can see it. But man, it's been so long since I've done this. When I was when I was paddleboarding, I was pretty good. Let's just play around for a second here. Time. This, I think I'm I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get that stability. And I think it's my foot placement too isn't great. So I just gotta work on that. Alright, let's let's back on out of here. See what we can do. Oh my gosh. Oh brother. Then I'm gonna have to make sure I come back in the same general area. Alright, let's just do a quick little just spin around here. Oh good, I left my stairs down on the boat, so 
Oh man, are you serious? <laughs> uh, now I could just kneel down. <laughs> okay, let's just calm down and get get Zen focus here. I went down the Ishinataki River on a paddleboard. It was my first long run. It was a couple miles, and I did pretty good. But right now, it's, oh, what, I can't believe I'm so unstable on this thing. And I feel like we're going way too fast. The wind's at our back. We got to go back the other way. Oh, man. All I want to do is get back to the boat and get off this thing. I'm going to have to practice on the lake a little bit. Oh, see, that feels good. Those are good strokes. I think it's, I just needed some forward momentum. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, thank you all for watching me fumble around on this board. Uh, we got the stickers on the boat, which is good. That was the main, the main goal. But since we had the paddle board, just wanted to try it. Um, I'm very unstable and I need to practice a lot more before we go do something exciting on this thing. <laughs> Oh, my stability is bad. So, thanks for watching. I will see you all next time. <laughs>